Hey guys, so today I'm in search of clearance finds for the month of July. There's a couple things I am keeping my eye on because I'm wondering if they'll be dropping in price anytime soon. So please don't forget to give this video a like since that truly helps on my channel very much. And well, let's get right to it. This is the Lacey Susan that has a chalkboard edge and it also comes with a soapstone pencil so that way you can kind of label, you know, if you're going to put different cheeses on it. I spotted it going for $12, normally sells for $20. I'm not sure if $12 is like the lowest price around. I want to say someone on social media found it going for $10, but these are becoming very rare now. If you want one of these Lacey Susans and if you spot at your local Costco, I'd probably just recommend to grab it at this point because I can tell Costco's are running very low in stock for this one. I spotted this acrylic drink dispenser also down to a clearance price. If you guys remember, Costco brought out one of these, but the last one they brought out was made of glass. What do you guys prefer? Do you guys like this acrylic one or the glass one? I know this one's definitely more lightweight compared to the glass one. That was my only thing um, that was kind of holding me back from buying the other one. But this one I spotted going for $16.97. It's barely starting to drop in price because normally it sells for $20. These Ninja Foodie Flex Basket air fryers are really hard to find now, but I noticed this Costco location had several of them. If anyone's interested in buying it at a clearance price, know that this Costco location in Tustin Ranch, this one I found it going for $99.97. Normally it sells for $130. I know there's been people out there that have found it much cheaper, but as you can see, they're like very high in stock here. So you can see they still have some air fryers here in the back. And again, these are very limited now. Costco's pretty much like done with these now. They're very hard to find. So this is pretty much your last chance. Here we have these non-slip cutting board sets of three pieces. All three of them are of different colors. These are dishwasher safe and they claim to be non-slip as well. I found them going for $7. So pretty much like half off the original price considering they normally sell for $14. All three of them are also of three different sizes. Start keeping an eye on these clear Trident Tumbler sets of eight pieces. I noticed these are starting to come down to a clearance price in several Costco locations. So these are of 23 fluid ounces. They're available in two colors, green and clear, by the way. I found them going for $8. Normally they sell for $17. I know at one point they had a coupon to them. If I'm not mistaken, the price came down to about $12 or so. So here you have the measurements for these tumblers and they're also BPA free. If you spot these in your local Costco, there's a good chance they're probably down to a clearance price. The Destination California, they're both like a cutting board. They also become like a grazing board or even used for wall decor. This one I found it going for $12. I want to say we've seen these before for eight, if I'm not mistaken, but I think by the time I got there, there was none left. So just know that the price can definitely vary quite a bit for this one. It normally sells for $25. This is the Blackstone six-piece griddle tool set. And this one pretty much includes two spatulas, one hamburger spatula, one griddle scraper, and then two 14-ounce bottles. I found this one going for $18. But I will say I was at a different Costco location just yesterday. And at that location, they were still selling it for $20. For the past two months, I found this Cosmetic Organizer's three-piece set down to a manager's discount. I did notice, though, some Costco locations are still listing it at $30, which is the original price. But if you find it with a discount, I think $20 has been the lowest price I've seen it go for. So it has um, one whole carousel and then two three-door organizers. In the carousel, obviously, it rotates, but you can also remove... Um, some of the little inserts so those little trays are removable and then the three door organizers are stackable great for like makeup or even if you want to organize some office supplies as well. I always thought these baskets were really nice ever since they first arrived to Costco. They were normally selling for $20 but I have seen not several Costco's have these anymore since they're pretty much like selling out quite quickly. At this Costco I spotted it going for $10 and as you can see a lot of people thought this was a great price. I probably have here one of the last baskets left. So if you're heading to Costco this week, definitely keep an eye out for these if you've been wanting them. This is a Jennifer Adams three-piece quilt set and it has one quilt and two shams. The material is pretty good. I wish I spotted it in a queen size though and not king. 
But if anyone has a king, just know, you know, you may want to keep an eye on this one too. It's selling for $25. Normally sells for $50. So this one's pretty much selling right now half off. There you have the measurements for both the quilt and the shams. I only spotted a blue here and then also gray. I believe there was also one in beige, if I'm not mistaken, and then also in a, like a greenish color. Uh, but right now, at least, I'm only seeing two different color options. These 32 degrees cool tees have amazing reviews online. A lot of people like these guys. And I noticed today they came down to a clearance price. Look at this, $9.97. They do have the duster on them. So I was very curious and I went to another Costco location and I actually saw them also. They had them at the exact same price. So I would probably say wait just a tiny bit more. And I mean, if you're okay with this price and just buy it, but you know, if they're not selling as fast, then I'm thinking the price might come down just a little bit more. But, and you, you know, it's like a risk you're gonna have to take. These come in a three pack and you do have two color options to choose from. By the way, when it comes to the sizing recommendation, I think normally I'm a large, but for these I had to get a medium. If you know that your local Costco carries these designer fragrances, I would highly recommend to double check the price this week. $49.97. I may not be no perfume expert, but I do know these bottles were selling for $100 each. Because at one point people were talking about them like all over the internet and they were saying how how good of a price it was for the bottle, uh, for the size of the bottle that you're pretty much getting. So half off if anyone's been wanting any of these designer fragrances, double check your Costco location. I've seen some Costco's carry these Adidas Pure Motion sneakers. I want to say this is like the second edition that they released because my husband has some that are very similar to these, but they're a little tiny bit different. But he got them like about a year and a half ago. Um, these I found them going for $19.97. Normally they sell for $37. And if these continue going like the way they are, I'm thinking, you know, these are gonna just going to sell out. I wouldn't risk, you know, waiting for a price drop on these because you can see they already have very limited sizing. These are the Ortholite Men's Jogger Sneakers by Steve Madden. If you guys remember, they brought these out in white and then also in gray. And so this is what they look like. They do have a little bit of a narrow toe in the front, but I don't think it's too, too narrow. Um, these I found them going first at $15, but I did go to another Costco recently and I spotted them going for six. So keep in mind, they normally sell for 33. But of course, if you find them, you know, probably anything less than $10, sizing is definitely going to be very limited. These are the men's Glide Light Pacer Shoe by Skechers. They have them in black. And then here on the bottom part are the navy blue ones. These are pretty stylish. They look comfortable. Did anyone purchase these, by the way, before? Normally, they sell for $35. And at this Costco location, I found them going for $27. So normally at one point they had sizes 8 through 13, but let me show you guys here some of the sizes that I spotted at this Costco location. Size 10.5, size 10, and then you can see down there they also have size 12. These are the Muddy Bites Milk Chocolate Waffle Cone Snacks. Did anyone try these? I did, and they're so delicious. So I actually made a paid partnership ad with this company. If anyone saw it, let me know. But I did post it on um, my Instagram page at Costco this week. And $6.97 is a great price considering the bag normally sells for $10. Six cones are on 130 calories. It does have around 13 grams of sugar. Of course, it's chocolate. But guys, this thing is so worth it. It's definitely very tasty. I love the advertisement for this sauce. It's called Just Put This On Everything Sauce by Chef Hacks. And so this one, you can see the expiration date. It's not until July of 2025. So pretty much like next year. They still have a couple bottles left. Actually, quite a bit. This one's selling for $5.97. Keep in mind, that's the price for two bottles. And the last time I saw this one at Costco was selling for around like $9.50, like close to $10. Two tablespoons, around 60 calories. 170 in sodium. There's a list of the ingredients as well. Let me know if you've tried it before. Here we have the keto friendly egg wedge turkey sausage and it has a very good amount of protein considering there's no bread and instead of the bread you have like pretty much egg and they you use that pretty much quote unquote as a bun. So you can see here the best buy date would be until October of 2025. 
Normally this one was selling for $14. In two Costco locations, I did see this one down to a clearance price pretty much. At this Costco, I found it going for $8. I believe the second location I saw this at was selling for $10. Here are the nutrition facts, 190 calories. It's less calories, of course, because there's no bread in here. So you can see even only have three grams of carbs. It does have around 17 grams of protein and 12 grams of fat. These are the Eggo Minis pancakes, 200 of them per each box. And I noticed another Costco location also had these down to a clearance price. So keep an eye on them. $9.97 would be the lowest price I've seen. And normally this one was selling pretty much for $12 a box. Here is my cheapest find of the day. And you know, nowadays you don't find anything at Costco for like less than $1, even $2 or $3 to be honest with you. But this one I found it going for 97 cents. 24 ounces of product of the jicama, pineapple, and mango salsa. Did anyone try it? I did notice of course that the expiration date for this one is probably a little too close, but it's very low calorie, 12 calories. And then you get about 28 servings in this container. I think this one's a little bit of a rare find. I, I spotted these Trisquit crackers and they're made pretty much with three simple ingredients. They're pretty good. I found them going for $6. Normally they sell for like very close to 12 bucks. So almost like half off pretty much. Six crackers around 120 calories. Has around three grams of dietary fiber, 160 in sodium and 20 grams of carbs. These are the Thin Mint Bites. I never got a chance to try these and it's kind of sad to see them leaving Costco, but I do know now that they have um, the other flavor of these bites. $6.97 for a 20 ounce bag. This one was originally selling for around $12.50 or so. Here are the nutrition facts, 140 calories for about nine pieces. Here are some other clearance finds I spotted through Costco.com. This is the Fantic L1 Ace Cordless Power Screwdriver, and I found it going for $29.97. I couldn't help but look at how many like reviews it has, eight reviews, and they all gave them five stars. So um, I also read one of the reviews, and someone said that they're still pretty much like on the first charge. So it seems like the battery's pretty good, and it lasts quite a bit. So here's all the little um, metal bits that it has or that it comes with. And then also, this is the Wood Sling Beach Chair by Tommy Bahama. It's going for $99.97. It's a eucalyptus wood frame, and it's pretty much foldable for easy storage, a weight capacity of 225 pounds. The Elo 17-piece straw and bottle brush set going for $12.97. This one, guys, I'm not seeing it in my area anymore. So if you didn't buy it in the warehouse um, or if it didn't arrive to your area, Buying it online might be the last option. It's available in purple. And then also here is the orange one. The Disney Alice in Wonderland Cheek Duo and Brush Set by Sigma Beauty. Guys, this thing is so cute. I'm not even that much of a Disney fan. But uh, this is so tempting. $29.97. So let's see. You get the Blush and Highlight Duo. So that must be this one. Yeah, that's what it is. A brush set with exclusive synthetic antimicrobial fibers and one chick storage bag. And the storage bag is what really got me. Look at this. I think it's glittery, if I'm not mistaken. That's adorable. The ring stick, uh, the ring stick up cam pro battery and indoor cam with manual privacy cover. You know, I actually own um I have the ring set up in my home. This one I found it going for $149.97. I'm sorry, I'm just kind of thinking here. I don't think, no, I have one indoor cam and then we have the floodlight camera from Ring. Um, both of them, I've been pretty satisfied with them. But I'm thinking, of course, this one's only indoor, so probably good for whenever we leave the dogs kind of at home, which is not very often, but, you know, it gives everyone a peace of mind. And that is all that I have for today. Remember to turn on your notification button to know when I have uploaded a new video. See you guys next time.